So, Samantha, uh, were you at all surprised when you got the SAG Ensemble nomination for Captain Fantastic? Yeah, that, I was like, I was sitting in school actually when I found out I was in my English class writing an essay and my mom texted me and I checked my phone when I shouldn't have yeah. <laughs> during this essay and I just was like freaking out and um, I, I like kind of started like tearing up a little bit because this has been like such a crazy journey from like, we filmed the movie like a little over two years ago and it went to Sundance and it went to Cannes and then, I mean with all this happening, it's just crazy and it's so well deserved and Jeannie McCarthy passed the movie, um, you know, we attribute so much of it to her, you know, best ensemble, really reflects the casting director, which is cool. So I'm, I'm completely thrilled and I can't wait for next week. What's wonderful about an award, an ensemble award, is that it's for the entire cast. Yes. And in a way, it feels like uh, everyone can celebrate. Yes. Uh, what was the feeling amongst the cast members? I think we just, we were just proud of each other. Because we know it was such a unique film just in the fact that we all are so close in real life. We text each other and email each other every day. We are always visiting each other. We are always hanging out with each other, staying with each other. Um, and so the chemistry on screen is so true off screen. So I think we were just proud of each other because we really are a family. And so it was just like all of our hard work and you know all of the bonding and you know our relationship obviously carried through. Um, carried into that nomination. So I mean, we were just very proud of each other. And of course, you get the opportunity to work with a veteran like Vigo. Yes. Um, I mean, you were all kind of relative newcomers, yeah. most of you. What did he, as a veteran actor, help give you that, uh, acting opposite him, that, that helped you with your own performance? He's just a very genuine and natural person. Uh, on, and, on and off screen as an actor and all of his performances, they're very real and very sincere, but he's like that off screen as well. Um, so I think he taught me to be a better actor in person outside of filming, and it carried over. But he just taught me to be very natural and just go with your instincts and don't be afraid to try new things. And then, of course, Matt Ross is a great actor in his own right. He's so. equally amazing. I adore him. What did he give you? Matt is just a very, very well-rounded, intelligent person. And he can look at both sides of an issue. And he, like, for him, and I steal this quote from him, you know, life is not black and white, it's utterly gray. And he taught me that. Um, so you can learn from everything. Um, and he's, he's just a very, very, very well-rounded person. Yeah, he's just taught me a lot. He's made me want to be more engaged in the world and read more and study more, and he's great. Well, congratulations, and thank, thank you so much. Thank you.